is architecture. For me, architecture is something which is unencompassing. It is something which literally we sit in, we sit with it, and it's something which influences everyone's life in all sorts of ways. And it's not just to do with the built environment that we live in architecture, we work in architecture and all the other facilities in life that surround us, but it's also, I think, somewhere a way of looking at the world around us. And from that point of view, I think architecture is something which cannot ever be divorced from our very existence. What can architecture do? I think architecture can do everything. If we go by what Sir Winston Churchill said, that it shapes our buildings, that we shape our buildings and then buildings shape our thoughts, to actually how our life is influenced by the kind of built environment that we have in. So I believe that architecture can actually influence how humans think and behave and react to situations and that's how society's ideals can be actually formed. So architecture in that sense I think is a very powerful tool of what the civilization will pan out to be. Well, the name of What is your architectural position? I would say my architectural position is the very fact that we need to understand and appreciate the power of architecture, the ability and the kind of uh, you know, potential the architecture has. So my own position of architecture is that we as architects need to really truly be the future thinkers. We need to be able to look into the power. We have created the deep horizon and be able to, it, through our work, through our writings, through our talks, we are able to shape the way society is going to find its ways and uh, of living in years and decades and centuries to come. So my position on architecture is that it is something which really can influence society, it can influence our way of thinking, and it, it's something where we need to really now bring the disciplines together. You know, this 20th century notion of over-specialization, of course, it, there's always a strength being the have and the specialization of a domain. But I think architecture is all-encompassing and therefore, whether it is interiors, whether it is uh, structures, whether it is environmental aspects, all this gamut of design really comes and becomes part of architecture again. What is your design method? My design method is really to you know, break the silos, as I said, of different fields of design, bring them all together, start looking at how architecture and society coexist, how architecture, the built component of architecture, the built environment and nature coexist, how art and architecture coexist. So in that sense, really, I feel that architecture we break all these aspects together and we, we really, whatever we create should be a reflection of all these ideas and reflection of all these disciplines. And that's the way to do.